I'm CC Chapman, co-author of the book Content Rules, founder of Digital Dads, and now the host and creator of PassionHit.TV. Uh, that's interesting. What's Passion Hit TV? So Passion Hit TV is a new show that I literally just launched yesterday. It profiles people that I call passion hits. A passion hit is a person, company, or event who has taken something they love doing and turned it into their livelihood. And I'm doing long-form interviews with these people, tell, asking them to share the, their journey, talk about what advice they would have for people going after that. Kicked it off with a great interview with Baratunde Thurston and going to be having a lot more great guests on it in the coming weeks. Awesome. That sounds great. So, um, can you give me an example of someone who's uh, doing video well for um, marketing? I think Sony right now is doing really well. I showed in my talk, Sony's got this great ad where they make the gamer be the hero. It's called For Michael. If you're on YouTube, look at it. And they have all these all the characters praising this guy, Michael, and you don't know who it is. And it's a, at the end, it's a guy gaming and a kid playing video games. And I just think it's they're doing some amazing ads. They're really playing off of you know the hero archetype and really know that they know their audience. Any gamer who watches this commercial is seeing their favorite characters come to life, and it's just it's genius. So you talk about it being a commercial. Is it a web-based video or is it a TV commercial? It's, a, it's both. It's a, there's a three-minute long-form video, high-res, on YouTube, but then they're, obviously they're running 30-second versions of it on television. So they realize they may only have a 30-second spot on television, but they've made this much richer, awesomer, awesomer? Yeah, we'll go with that. Awesomer, uh, long-form, three-minute version, and that's online. They can have both. So I think they're, they're doing everything across the board perfectly. Awesome. Um, and so how are you? using video in your business? I'm using video a lot where you know I do a lot of speaking and by having video captured of me speaking it helps me get more speaking gigs. Um, I also like to just get in front of the camera and sometimes it's more fun to do a video post rather than I don't want to take the time to write I'd rather just fire up the camera and speak passionately into it and not worry about the grammar and getting it all formatted and that's why that's where I love video. People love that authentic voice right? They, they see you they know that you're not just hiding behind your words there's no way to, you can't really fake it on video. I mean, not that easy. Um, when you record yourself on video, what equipment do you use? Currently, uh, it depends. I have, I have a Kodak ZI8, or Z, next, not, no, what are they now? ZI10s, the Play Touch. Yeah. I use for my little compact one. And then I have a Sony, I've heard it's MXR50P or something. It's a really nice little handy cam that I use. That's my go to one that I use. And it's funny because I'm part of this pen ready campaign too, and I've never, I haven't, I shot my first video clips at dinner last night on it, and I haven't looked at it yet. Oh. But I know the audio is going to be horrible because I hadn't seen this thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, I, and, and I use whatever camera I have with me. I've shot with my iPhone because that's always in my pocket, too. I think don't worry about the tech so much as what you what you have handy with you. Exactly. Where can people find you on the web? Easiest place is cc-chapman.com or on Twitter at cc underscore Chapman. Excellent.